Hey guys, just a super quick video talking about how I think that we should show each other more respect. You know, each of us is a, a different being. Sure, we're made of the same stuff. We have a heart, lungs, skin, bones. But we've each had a unique upbringing, and especially in our mind. You know, our minds are unique. So the point of this video, I'm going to get straight to the point, is that let's show more support and positivity and love towards, towards each other. You know, if I say um, one day I'm going to develop powerful abilities like telekinesis and flight, you know, that's up to me. Obviously, I have my own beliefs and my own ways of training and I'm happy with my own training techniques. So we all have our own techniques that we do or methods. And if we're not happy with our own, we can go searching for other people's techniques or whatever. But the point is that, you know, we've got a, like a special community here, guys. And we should be more showing more kindness and more love. I know um, most of us do already, but there's still a few people who who want to be right, who try to push their ego. You know, they they may think they're doing something good by pushing their belief or pushing what the, the technique that they think is correct. But let's take a step back and show a little more respect for each other. We're all trying to achieve the same thing. It doesn't matter if you're training Qigong, Neigong, um, doing some kind of sorcery training or psionics training or, or whatever it is. We, we can all contribute something to this community. We all have knowledge that we can share and pass around and for some people it'll help them, for others maybe not. But I just want this community to be more supportive. I know, I know some people, they won't post YouTube videos for fear of people giving them hate. People looking down on them. People telling them they're wrong or they're stupid. I just want there to be more love in our community. You know, the technique that works for you might not be the technique that works for me or for the other, this other person. If it works for you, fine, great. You can suggest it to other people. You can let people know your technique, but don't push them, push it onto them. Don't tell them, this is the technique. This is the only technique that you can use to achieve your goal. Because when you say that, you are you're not only you're making yourself look ignorant, but you're putting yourself in a box. You're putting your mind in a prison. You're telling yourself, I can't achieve this any other way. But if you open your mind and allow yourself to accept all possibilities, even though I have my own techniques for telekinesis and levitation, I'm always open to listen to other people's ideas and I'm always very happy and it makes me, you know, it makes me feel happy to, to hear your ideas because I'm always looking for something that can improve on my own techniques or can make my own training more effective or more efficient. So please don't think that your technique is the right one and is the only one, you know, we're all, we're all human. We, we all have a heart and no one likes to be told, you know, directly that they're wrong, their beliefs are wrong and, and they're not going to like it. And there's no reason to hurt or try to put other people down. You know, you're just you're just making yourself look bad if you do that. You know, I'm I'm guilty of 
this occasionally in the past, maybe a few years ago, or whatever. But I, I gradually pulled myself out of that, uh, out of that, you know, negative space. Now I try to be a more positive person, try to show more love, because I understand we're all striving to achieve the same goals. We all want these supernatural powers. So why not just try to help each other instead of trying to hurt each other? Let's just show more love for each other, guys. Like I said, I know most of you are very respectful already. And, you know, I, I appreciate that. You know, we've got something good here. Our little community, we've got something really special. And most of us are supportive of each other. For, for growth and expanding our awareness and our consciousness. Like I said, it's excellent, it's great to share our knowledge, pool our knowledge together, and that way all of us can grow. But, you know, let's try, not, try our best not to hurt each other's feelings, because some of us are more sensitive than others, and, you know, if you type, type something bad or negative in the comments or whatever, it might affect someone, you know, deeply in their life. In, in ways that maybe you didn't think about. So, I understand that negativity can be addictive. That's why, you know, the news and media is so negative all the time. That's why people love to watch it. But let's strive to be different. Let's strive to just support each other with more love and more kindness and make our community even more great. So the people who come into our community, you know, they're shocked at how nice we are. So that's all I wanted to say. There's no special message in this video. I know in myself, in my heart, that I'm not going to grow, I'm not going to be able to achieve telekinesis or flight through being negative or holding on to negative feelings. I know that so many times in my own life when I haven't been feeling good or been feeling down for some reason or angry, I can't do my training, I can't do my practice, I just can't do anything. Which means that happiness and love and, and positivity is the nourishment that we in this community, striving to achieve these supernatural powers, this is what we need. This is all we need to keep a positive, happy mindset. And those few who may not believe in the power of love and the power of kindness, Trust me, guys, it, it is the way, it is the way to go for true fulfillment. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you again soon.